So, quite severe tremors, and what if I were to ask you to hold a bottle of water and drink? You probably couldn't. Oh. And can you tell me your name now? So, you developed a severe voice tremor, um, head tremor, and, and postural hand tremors, and quite you could not do any single with your hands I, right now. I could, I can't write or eat, and I notice that I'm shaking. It's worse. It's time it goes by. Seems worse. But you don't notice it when you are on the simulation. No. You have absolutely no symptoms. So I'm going to go ahead and turn the stimulator back on. Marilyn, thank you so much for letting me turn it off so we can show what you like on and There you go. Back on the stimulation. Thank you. <laughs> it's a lot better. It's a lot, it's a lot better. better. You forget how severe your tremors are unless I you turn do. the stimulation off. I am just so grateful and so used to it. I, I don't even think about it. I don't see some essential tremors. Yes. And DBS. Yes. How old are you then? 77. Okay. So when were you diagnosed with essential tremors? Uh, about seven years ago. And what kind of problems did you have? Anything to do with my hands. Anything. Eating. Hair, dressing, makeup, writing, typing. Severe tremors. Yes. Were there things that you couldn't do anymore because of the tremors? Be my job was drawing diagrams in part, and uh, so it affected that as well as everyday living. So medications were not helpful. None at all. And you had side effects. Yes. Yes. Okay. So you underwent DBS surgery how many years ago? Five, almost five. Five years ago, okay. And how did DBS surgery help you? I, I get, there is no way to explain. You can't, I can't not have it. It's, it stopped your tremors? It is, it's wonderful. It does change your life. Okay, so now you can use your hands and do Anything All the things, I want. anything you want. Anything no restrictions. I want. No, okay. Not a thing in the world. I just have grown to take it for granted. 